So we got Pseudo Muswala featuring AR Paisley with, uh, from what I've seen, the last upload on Sidhu's uh, YouTube channel. It's called Drippy. Also, uh, people are asking me, were asking me to react to this song. So here we are. <coughs> I, w I was thinking, why is it like um, they recorded uh, in the studio while the song was playing in the studio? Why? Why was it that? I thought that that's uh, from the, to the end. That's gonna play to the end like that. Yeah. Crazy he said when did you came out of jail what's up with you it seems like even today someone's on your radar tell me what's in your heart and what's in your pocket bro referring to a gun so the person he's talking about just came out of jail and still didn't forget probably who put him there <laughs> <laughs> Yo, this is a gangster song. What is D, bro? He said, straighten up your gaze, right? Don't mess with me mentally. Don't swing that much. Control your wa your waist. He's containing himself not trying to burst in flames towards everybody not trying to you know unalive because that's how you supposed to say these days uh on youtube uh, <laughs> he said has no hang hunger for living people to put them down to right okay <clears throat> So I'm fighting. The, he said the enemy is in his mind, the betrayal in his heart. So you should run right now while you still can, because he's still fighting himself and he's st still containing himself. But you know, then he he asking that specific person, why are you messing with me? Why are you trying to be sent to the other realm? right just don't mess with me move on carry on with your life just leave me alone leave me at peace let me let me um deal with my stuff don't push me I have to read that. Life these days can be trusted. The misconception the misconceptions should not be maintained. Seeing me as a jut from Malwa, a six foot two man, like big strong man, they feel they felt goosebumps. Oh, the girl from Maja 
was feeling goosebumps seeing him. Okay. See, he had a plan. Yeah. Look. See, he had a plan. I bought it a van and squeeze on that trigger as fast as he can. Make sure it don't jam and he'll get the band. He'll bring the money right back to his fam. This is on you. It's not on me. It's in your hands. Do you understand? Don't get nervous. Just stay focused. Aim at his dome. Leave him where he stands. All of these exactly. That, that's what I've been <laughs> yapping about until this point. Bitches, they just a distraction. All of this and all of this fashion. All of this love and all of this madness. All of these guns and all of this action. Damn. All of this drilling and all of this trap and all of the bodies that's dropping and hitting the floor. Whoa, shit is so tragic. And in other words, uh, Sido is trying to tell all of y'all, stay in your lane. Mind your business. Stay away from me. Don't push me because you don't want to do that. Fuck it, I'd rather do this on my own. I'm by myself. Stop hitting my phone. I realize a lot. And now that I'm grown, I don't need nothing. I'll do this alone. And he yeah. says, How could I tell say, if that was my dog? Words. If he's moving shicey, I don't need nothing. I'll do this alone. Yeah. How could I tell if that was my dog? If he's moving shicey. If she was a hoe, then how can I trust her when she says she white feet? Oh. Stop playing these games because out in these streets, the shit could get pricey. Cost you your life, so don't take that lightly. Hold that street. If she was a hoe, then how can I trust her when she says she white feet? Stop playing these games, cause out in these streets, the shit could get pricey. So he's talking to a girl as well. They talking to, you know, people in general, with gangsters in general. Stop pushing me, mind your business, and all of that. But they also say, you know, I fell in love with this girl and she keeps playing games with me that's why he said if she is a hoe and then but she says she says to me that she's a wifey material right you know she has to prove that but if i found out in other ways that she's not she's just lying to me <clears throat> ish could be pricey could cost you your life so don't take that lightly that, that's funny he said he has a drip of a shooter and then you hear that child smiling laughing <laughs> bro bro that's <laughs> Why was it no from no license plates? Quote unquote. <laughs> Motherfucker. <laughs> 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 yeah, that's pretty much it. Right, so I do agree with this message, but um, in my case, I do not have to unalive people and stuff, but I did have had to find a hard way exactly what they, they, they talking about. I did have to find the hard way that people around you are uh, of two types is the ride or die with you right the real real friends and the the people who use you most of the times it happens because you show i don't know empathy you your your vibe is all positive is all like it happened to me right i'm all for positivity i'm all for helping people i'm all for uh, gathering people and help each other and i'm all for positive vibes right and 
it happened so many times to me that people misconceive that that part they see me all laughing smiling doing stupid jokes or you know stuff like that because i, I like to to act like a child sometimes i like to well, well not with anyone right i'm in for example later uh, the last time it happened was at my workplace where i find these uh these people that i do engage with do talk a lot with have jokes and, and stuff like that so from time to time you know i do silly jokes or even stupid jokes <laughs> or childish jokes that that's who i am that that that's who and what i am right other people to the side and watching me acting childish and all that and they they thought i'm just a kid because I was doing that because I, I, I have no Fs to give, right? And at some point I had to check them because they really thought I'm all I'm all just a, a stupid kid. And if they act tough around me, I'll get scared and, and go sit in my corner. So I had to check them <laughs> to show them that's not the case. I'm acting like this because I love positivity. I love I love making people laugh. I'm, I love, you know, living my life. So yeah, that's what they, they talk about. You know, you, you see me, this soft, nice, positive person, but don't try it with me. Don't, don't try to, <laughs> to test me because you might not like the, the end result. And on top of that, why would you do that? Why? Just mind your business. Anyway, I'm uh, talking a lot because these are life experiences and you, some of you really need to understand that. Or to learn from that. That's practically the message. So yeah, that being said, I'm gone. <laughs>